Before we get into today's episode, I want to put my condolences out there to Bianca Devins. May you rest in peace. What an absolute and utter tragedy. And the All of Us community feels for you and your family. Let's get into it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Tesla Therapy. As always, my name is William D. Bacari. You can find me at The Agitated Rock on Twitter. You can find all of us studios on all the social media platforms, Twitter, Instagram, and all of the above. We live stream every Friday and Saturday night on twitch.tv slash all of us studios, and you can catch us there. And you can also catch us at usinfinity.com where we have a Patreon set up, and you can also take a look at some of the merchandise that we have on our website. Enough of that today. Um, we're going to talk about... Bianca Devins. What a tragedy. Um, I'm almost speechless. I I have thoughts. I'm not really sure how to put them into words yet. Um, it's a member of our gaming community, obviously. Member of the social community as a whole. Um, it just exploits the absolute nasty and visceral side that social media can have. Um, Social media is a wall, guys. It's a wall. You get to hide behind a wall and be someone or create something that you may or may not even believe in. You can hide behind your identity, which is just a username at that point, and you can share your opinions about anything and anyone. How do you honestly feel about that? Now, like I've said before, I'm 31 years old. I grew up and transitioned from basically not even having internet through dial-up internet all the way to where we are today in 2019. How did we get here? No restrictions? Things growing too fast without any sort of regulatory nature in place? Uh, like I said, community, I'm... I'm at a loss for words, but I have a lot of thoughts. And the bottom line is, is that we need to fucking treat each other better. Coming from a counseling and a therapy standpoint, there had to be alarms. There had to be something that was in place beforehand. There had to be either preconceived notions or something that led this Brandon gentleman, his her boyfriend at the time, to do what he did. And I... <laughs> For the life of me, there are signs. There's always signs. And so, why were these signs not picked up on? Is there something that was just thrown underneath the rug that wasn't really addressed? Maybe something that's been escalating for a long time between these two? I don't know. And ultimately, I want to know because it's going to make society better to be able to be more informed. And selfishly, I want to know for my own career, for my own path. I want to be able to dissect that mentality. I want to be able to understand where both parties, you know, even tragically the gentleman as well too, are coming from. It's just completely an utter nonsense. Treat each other better, guys. I'm sorry this video is a little hot-handed and, and, and visceral and, and intense, but guys, we need to do better. That's why Brian and I have created this channel. That's why Tesla Therapy exists. That's why I'm hosting this show is to be better. Just be better. That's all I have for you guys today. Rest in peace, Bianca. The community loves you.